Hey everybody, this is American Life Winter, so today I'll be making a video of the NG August 2021 releases. These are not as many releases as Gemini Jets did, but these releases are still awesome, and I would recommend you to get some of these models. So before this video begins, make sure to like and subscribe and turn on the post notification bell if you don't want to miss a discount. So yeah, let's get started. First of all, we have the Skymark, 7 version 800. Skymark? Sounds like an impersonator of Sky Marks. And registered as Julio Alpha 73 Alpha Bravo. It's in the new Pokemon colors. This is a really nice plane if you are you like Pokemon. But honestly, I do not like looking at these kind of special liveries. No hate to this airline, but I just, in my opinion, Next, we have the Delta 737 900 ER, registered as November 913 Delta Uniform with the scimitar index. This is a plane I've been looking for for a very long time from Gemini Jets. Because if you still remember that I got scammed on Amazon, like I ordered the 737 900 Gemini Jets, and then instead I got the 800. It was so bad, like I really didn't like it. But here we are, NG model stepped in and made me pretty happy to get this model. I may not get it, but you know, I kind of feel a bit happy with NG models. So, um, so you definitely just recommend a plane. This is a incredibly rare to get if you're going to get it on eBay. Like, internationals or scams are really, really, really expensive planes. So, yeah, definitely should get that. Much better than your Gemini. Okay, next we have the Japan 787-9, registered as Julia Alpha 863 Julio. This is actually a nice one to get. Like I would get this for my San Francisco airport updates, but you know I don't really need these kind of planes because I don't feel like getting them. Like I barely see these kind of 787s at SFO from Japan or I see more of the triple sevens and the A and A see both of I see seventy sevens frequently more. And that's kinda of like an opposite of eight seventy sevens and triple sevens. Yeah, I'd recommend a plan if you're gonna have if you're doing like international airport updates. Okay, and after that, we have the Aircast 77 9 registered as Charlie Fox Vector Lima Cubic. This is the flag, the flag, um, Tokyo 2020 Olympic Games for that kind of livery. This plane actually looked really nice. I saw this plane on Flat Ridge before. Would definitely recommend you getting this plane. And this is fly to fly from the middle of the fuselage to the end. The Gold Canada Go. And after that, we have the regular livery. And then register as Charlie Fonta Romeo Tango Girl. Regular livery, nothing special, but at least they re released this and you don't have to worry about buying this from Gemini Jets or finding this way too rare and you have to pay a lot for that model. Next, we have this pretty special model, it's the Hawaiian 77 9 registered as November 78 Hotel Alpha. So if you guys don't know the Hawaiian Airlines, they did not take the delivery of their 77 yet, but the, the test flight is already going on and one of them has been produced. It's only 0.2 years old, so it's actually pretty young. Yes, this is a really special plane, so I recommend you getting this. After that, we have the Turkish Airways AT3200. First one, again, is in the... It's for the Tokyo 2020 Olympic Games. And registered as Tango Charlie Julia November Bravo. I personally like the liveries, personally this kind of part of the plane looks really really nice, but again I don't need this model. And then the second one is the is same thing, but without the livery is Tango, Charlie, Julio, November, Echo. Regular livery, nothing too special. Yeah. And after that, we have the SAS AP5900, registered as a Sierra Echo Romeo Sierra Bravo. Um, so you know, NG models has the 
gear, like it's really, really tall. And also their nose is quite, I think it's quite a bit sharp. And around here, the nose is, the windows are quite bending down. It's supposed to be a little bit straight up. So, and Aviation 400 released this plane, so I definitely would recommend you getting this from Aviation 400. Or Gemini just because they're more accurate than the A350s, but you know, it's still... But you know, in models it, it isn't that bad as Phoenix A350s. And then the name is Hadbar Viking, that's the name of the plane. And then, we have the last two models, it's the Lutanza A350-900. First one is, it's registered as... Delta Alpha India X-Ray Piper and it's in a new Lufthansa and new hashtag together again colors. Actually really nice delivery. I really like the how this um thing of like definitely need a Lufthansa A250 ASAP. So probably I might get that. Last but not least, we have the same thing but without delivery, it's just new color. Registered as Delta Alpha India X Ray Cubic. It's regular level, nothing too special about this plane. Yeah, that'll be all for this video today. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe to not post another video below. If you want to miss any of this kind of, and I really recommend you getting the release this year, especially the Delta Airlines Air Canada or the Hawaiian. Really recommend you getting that. So, yeah, see you guys in the next video.